Hi, this is Lisa Mason Mentor, and today's resolution question of the day is, can I use sugar while taking resolution drops? And your answer is actually yes. However, there are restrictions, and we're going to go over here and look at the actual resolution product guide. This is the official product guide released by Total Life Changes for Resolution 20. Okay, and so we're just going to scroll down. And I'm going to show you where you can actually find what kind of sugar. Now, you'll see there's all kinds of information here. You can actually use Stevia and Sweet and Low. They are allowed. Okay, they are the only ones allowed. Stevia and Sweet and Low. Okay, you don't see honey on there or anything like that. I'll tell you what's not allowed. You cannot have aspartame, sucralose, which is Splenda, or regular sugar. They are not allowed. And honey is not on this list either, okay? So you should have no additional added flavors or ingredients in the tea packets or bags, including fruit, rosebuds, honey, etc. And do not consume pre-bottled teas. Now, you can have IASO tea, uh, but don't add anything additionally to your tea while you are on resolution. Okay, so that is the answer to your question. Yes, you can have stevia and sweet and low. If you actually want to find out uh, where you can get your hands on that official product guide, just go here to iosoresolutiondrops.com. If you'd like to be a part of our resolution challenge and lose 30 pounds in 30 days and be added to our private Facebook group, just go here to lose 30 in 30 days.com. I hope that this helped answer your question for today. Again, if you want to get your hands on that uh, free meal plan and approved foods list, just go to iosoresolutiondrops.com. I want you to have an awesome day. Be blessed.